Hey y'all, so I am here today sharing with you my office walkthrough. I've had lots of other people ask me because they know that I have been like working on my office for what seems like forever and I don't know about y'all but organization makes me just feel so much more in control of my life. So if you feel more organized or feel better when you're organized, let me know. And before you go ahead and say that I'm psycho for labeling everything, I label everything. Number one, I know where my things are. However, if I'm wanting to have my husband or my kids help me, it makes it a whole lot easier instead of saying the second drawer to the left. So I labeled everything because I like to be able to tell them where things go, where they don't go, etc. Um, I'm going to go ahead and tell you that in my link tree, I have my Amazon list and a referral link for Container Store because that's where a lot of that stuff came from. But, um, so let me go ahead and share. So this setup behind me is from Ikea. All of these are just stacked on top of each other. These are the Calyx, K-A-L-L. AX shelves and I just stacked them on top of each other. I did get some doors to hide my things. That's what I love the most. So here I just have like some extra mailing supplies. Down here that's where I keep my bulbs. If you guys have these um, these shelves from Ikea, these little skinny containers, they're from Target they can fit side by side in here and so I just stack them so that's where I keep my light bulbs definitely let me know if you are loving this or if there's anything that you have a question about more bulbs down here like I said I like to use these bins because you can stack so much in them this is just um, felt samples for my customers oh gosh all right once again, down here, I have more samples in those same exact bins. Like, those bins are what I love for the um, things with the doors, okay? And then I did get some with drawers. And in my drawers, I just have other little organizers that hold postcards. Because for me, I can work so much faster if everything's separated. I know that, like, a lot of other people will just like throw their stuff all together and they're like, you're just doing way too much, but I need everything separated. I keep, let's see, yeah, y'all can see. I keep more postcards right there and then right here, I keep a bunch of ribbon with my scissors usually in here so I can just pull the ribbon out and I'm ready to tie my bags right here, ready to go. And then obviously you guys can see that I have some product. And I am not on here trying to sell anybody anything. So nobody should turn me into compliance because that's not what this is about. Okay, over here, these containers right here, these are from Container Store. They're the Like It model containers and you can stack them. So down here I have just a bunch, like all my extra testers. Here I have bag parties that are ready to go. They're already packaged and ready. So if you are a consultant, you need to have your bag parties packed and ready, okay? Um, and then here, it's just like extra bags, empty ones. Usually on these shelves right here and right here is where I put orders that I've packaged up that are ready to go out to customers, okay? And let's see, over here, this is probably one of my favorite parts. I found this really cool cart at Michael's. This one is longer than the other cart that I used to have. And so I love, love, love all of the cart things. And then I have these containers inside of it to keep everything separate. So like I have my counter clean and my fresh separately. If you just joined, please do not feel like you need all of these things. Do not go spend a million dollars. This is five years worth of work, five years worth of getting all the things. And I finally feel like I have it under control and it's taken me this long. So, um, like I said, there's just lots of different, I keep all my samples 
separate. I love the cart because I can just move it around. Um, bag parties, I um, usually, honestly, I usually have like eight in and out, but because of COVID, it's been really, really difficult. Um, but it is what it is. The cart is from Michael's and I'm telling y'all, if you can find the one that's like longer, this one is so good. Like, I love it. I do have a sample problem. So I have more samples like down here in these little longer bins. So obviously they don't all fit on the cart, but I keep them in these long bins, okay? All right, then over here, whoop, my light's about to fall. These right here are also the Like It model containers from Container Store, okay? I've labeled them with all the things. These are just extra brick samples that I've gotten. This door organizer right here, so many people ask me about that. That is the Alpha brand door organizer from the container store. I'm telling you, there's not a container store in Fayetteville. We have to drive like an hour, hour and 15 minutes. I have been four times in the last like three weeks. They know me there. It's a whole situation because a lot of things you can't have shipped right now. Why? I have no idea, but whatever. So, and then this is one of my projects that I have recently started and I'm waiting on more bins because it drives me crazy that they're different colors, number one, and I need more of them. So here I have all of my different mailing supplies and my bags, and I've labeled them poly mailers, small bubble, big bubble, small bags, medium, medium, large, and large bags. It's a whole situation. My husband thinks I'm crazy. And then over here on the side, you can't really see it, but I just have some plastic other drawers because if you have closets like mine, I'm just going to pray for you because I hate these closets because they have an angled ceiling. So I can take this off here and show y'all what all I have. Let me turn this around. So these are also from the container store. I have more of these coming so that they match um, because I like the drawers better because then that way I'm not having to like open them and move them all around. So these are all the different labels for my different size bags that I have. Once again, you do not have to hold all these things at your house. It's just what I do, okay? So I have pri like team prizes. I buy things like as I see them. I have earn a kit party packs, all the different like candies and things like that that I do. I keep all of that in here. And then like I said, over here are just like some of the other examples of the plastic the plastic containers because my pro tip for that is get them that are all the same size so that they stack, okay? If they don't stack, it's going to make your life very difficult. And I had lots of different ones, and so that made my life difficult. Okay, so my office is also where I get ready. So I still have I have these drawers over here. All of these drawers, by the way, are not IKEA. All of these white drawers, besides that one that's over there on I'll show it to you. All of these white drawers are from Michaels. You can totally get the ones from Ikea. Our Ikea is three hours away. And so I was just trying to make do with what I have. I like them. I um, actually put them on some hairpin legs though, instead of the roller, instead of the wheels, because it was too low to the ground. So I bought some hairpin legs off of Amazon to make it a little bit higher. The chair's from Amazon. I love this chair, it's my favorite. Then over here in my corner, I have my printer, which I just stacked all the way up there. My husband says it's a bad idea, but who cares? And then this cabinet is actually from Lowe's. It's like a garage cabinet, but that's where I keep all my paper and like just stuff that I don't want to look at. Okay, here I keep my catalogs and then I have my Dymo printers. A lot of people have asked about those. Do not invest in one of those until you're doing a ton of mail outs because it's just not important to go and spend the money on that when you can print it from your regular printer, okay? You can print from stamps.com, from pirate ship everywhere from your regular printer. I just got tired of switching my stuff in and out, okay? Um, I have the 
HP Office Jet Pro 9025. It is on my Amazon list, but the bit the best investment that I ever made was HP Instant Ink. I know a lot of people don't want to pay the subscription service, but my ink would literally be gone in days. Like I would go through ink cartridges like three or four times a week. And I'm telling you, I don't know what it is about the HP Instant Ink pack cartridges. Those actually work. And like they send them to you and it's so worth your money, like 100% worth the money. Um, I swear the cartridges that you like buy at... Uh, Walmart, Target, wherever, I swear they're like half full because it's ridiculous how little amount of ink you get out of it. Um, the Dymos were just something that I treated myself to because once I, my husband used to do all of my stamps.com when I was um, still working my teaching job. But now that I'm at home, I took over that and I was just done switching the paper in and out. Okay. Also, the van, the, so I know I told y'all that these desk bought or the drawers are from Michael's. The top for this one is from con container store, but then my computer over here, I could not get another white top from the container store. So I took a chance and I tried this one. It is a little bit, it's not as white, but I'm obsessed with it anyway. It's like the Vivo brand. I've also linked it on my Amazon so that you guys can see. Um, and then we just put it on there with Velcro. Okay. And then over here, I just have labels for all of my different things. Because if you're not labeling, it's going to be very difficult. Um, so I keep my stamp stuff, my different size paper, like my different chargers, supplies, over there, I have new consultant packets, join info packets, leader packets, order forms that are already ready to go, extra copies, extra party stuff is down here. Um, I have an, a folder or a um, drawer for my consultant hand guide and product training guide because those need to be next to your desk every day. Because if you're not using them, you need to be if you're a consultant. That is your Bible for a consultant. I just got that light. It's actually pretty bright. Um, oh, I think my ring light's about to fall over. Okay. Um, anything else y'all want to see? I actually, um, oh, this, I can show y'all these too. Let me take this off. Ooh. All right. And then once again, I have all the different things labeled. My husband makes fun of me because my labels have labels. And then, oh, these. I forgot about these. This was my baby. Okay, so these are from Container Store. I went back and got a ton more. So now I have these containers that come out and they hold my postcards. Okay, so I have my team postcards. I have just like regular cards. I have all my promotion mail. My Dymo stuff, those are just some prizes. If you don't have a labeler like this, you need one. This is what I've labeled everything with. All of my extra, like, stickers. My party packs that are ready to go. These are, like, my product labels. All of the different things. My daughter is awake. Um, my Facebook part. Yeah, so right here, you may have just popped on. This is my like setup up here and I would turn on those lights and like I would move some of those oils and stuff. But um, when I do a Facebook party, that's, I just do it in here. I don't know if y'all can hear my daughter, but does anybody have any other questions? I am super excited to have gotten to share that with you. Um, like I said, I finally feel like I'm getting it together. If anybody else has any other suggestions for how to organize any of the things, I love organization. It makes me so happy. And I appreciate y'all for coming or coming to watch this. I know a lot of people probably don't care, but I always love to see how people organize their stuff because if you don't get organized, it's a whole situation. Last thing I'm gonna share, my pegboard. Um, that is where I keep my bars. I love my pegboard because it gets everything like to where I can kind of see it. Um, the pegboard was from Lowe's. The one thing I'll say about the pegboard, 
is I wanted to keep mine organized by like alphabet or by color. I'm about to have to get off here. But because you're always getting like things are going out and things are coming back in, it's like impossible. So I just do it the best that I can. Um, I definitely suggest getting the pegs for from Amazon though. The pegs from Lowe's are just not as good and you can get the longer ones. So you can actually hold like seven bars on one peg. All right, I love y'all. I appreciate y'all for um, tuning in. And yes, I'm gonna upload this to YouTube so I can post the YouTube link as well. Hope y'all have a great rest of your day. Let me see, I don't even know how to end this right now. <laughs>